Time now for some entertainment news at midday. You know, learning history can sometimes be a little less than exciting. Teachers are always looking for new ways to present their lesson plans. And at Granbury High School, one teacher is breaking with tradition. It's a unique program based on a World War II hero and his portrayal in Unbroken. But we don't walk the walk. It was a red carpet moment in Highland Park for teacher Heather Fuller and her social studies class. They attended the premiere of Unbroken, Path to Redemption. A moment of pain is worth a lifetime of glory. The inspiration, Louis Zamperini, the Olympic track runner, became a World War II hero. His plane shot down over the South Pacific. He spent 47 days at sea and two years in brutal prison camps. His story was recounted in the bestseller Unbroken, which became a 2014 movie. Fuller began reading the book to her class. By the time I'm done reading on the first day, there's audible groans when the bell rings. And so I knew I was on to something. So she created a curriculum around Zamperini's story, breaking the mold of typical history lessons. It resonates on so many different thematic levels with the ideas of hope, faith, and dignity. It allowed the students to uh, see a different perspective um, within a larger context. At one point, students tape off the classroom floor in the outline of a life raft like the one Louis survived on. And I have the students get in small groups and, and say what they think about this situation. How would they have struggled differently? Do they see themselves in that story? And tales of the students' own struggles pour out. They write how they're inspired to keep going themselves. Way deep down inside, I knew I wasn't okay, but I knew that if Louis, if Louis Zamperini could do this, then I knew that I could do this. I uh, probably consider myself agnostic when I started reading this, and then seeing God present himself in multiple ways to Louis really stuck out to me. And that's before the sequel. When we heard there was a second film coming out, I, I didn't even have to explain to them. They're like, I'm seeing it. It's, I know it's going to be the rest of the story. Turns out, Zamperini's story wasn't always the stuff of glory. I just thought I'd be able to forget everything. He married when he returned home from imprisonment, but fell into alcoholism, suffering from PTSD at a time when no one knew how to treat it. That's largely the focus of the new movie, Unbroken, Path to Redemption. He finally finds the faith after his wife persuades him to attend a Billy Graham revival. You need help. Fuller won't shy away from that part of Zamperini's life journey in her class. Learning about the low points is also character building. But there's a lifeline. Just reach out. You could have this counterculture that could fight the, the lack of, of hope that we see in our society in our modern era. And that's powerful because that's how you work towards solutions. And kudos to that educator. Fuller's Unbroken curriculum is now used in 40 schools in Texas, and it's going nationwide. As for the movie, Unbroken Path to Redemption is in theaters tomorrow.